My name is Madeleine de Toy. I'm currently a professor in the School of Mechanical Materials and Mechatronics Engineering in the Faculty of Engineering and Information Sciences and I work in the Welding Engineering Research Group. Well, our, our research group focuses on anything to do with welding and joining processes. So we have a strong focus on automation of welding, so using robotics to, um, to automate welds. We also look at the metallurgy of welds, um, specifically at materials like steels, stainless steels, aluminium and titanium. And we also have a focus on welding processes. So using existing processes and, and developing new processes for different applications. Okay, titanium has become a very important engineering material. It has a very unique combination of properties. It's very lightweight because it has a low density, but it also has a high strength, which means it gives us a very good strength to weight ratio, which is attractive for aerospace applications. It also has very good corrosion resistance, and it's often the only metal or alloy that we can use in highly corrosive environments. Titanium research is an ongoing project in the department and it was, um, the initial work was done by a PhD student called Nick Hoy, who recently graduated. And he examined the wire-based additive manufacturing of titanium. So using a normal welding process to deposit layers of titanium to build up a component. He found that the, the grain structure of these titanium additive manufactured layers uh, tend to be a bit coarse, which can affect the mechanical properties. So we decided to launch a project to look at how we can improve the, the structure of those additive manufactured layers and get better mechanical properties from the components. We're only in the beginning stages of this project, so we are at, at the moment just doing the, the backup research. But what we'd like to, to see in future is the results of this research being fed back into industry um, specifically to the consumable manufacturers that make the wire that's used to weld titanium um, and hopefully to get them to change the compositions of their wires by introducing some of the compounds we're developing at the moment and we believe that will have a major impact on the aerospace industry where they should be able to get better properties from the welds in any application where titanium is welded but also in the general engineering field. Um, for example, the welding of big titanium pressure vessels or pipes or, or tanks, where you can get much better properties with a, a grain-refined weld. 